Okay, here's a quick training video on the new Animal Care Scooping Wheelbarrow. Uh, this is to stay in the pasture lockout. It's only to be used for scooping. Uh, only to go to and from the big barn or to and from the manure pile. If you want to use this to carry material or take it off of the asphalt road at any time other than the manure pile, you need to get my approval first. So as you can see, it's got two flat free wheels, which is nice. Um, so they're, they're pretty hard. Uh, it, it's very sturdy now that it's got two wheels as opposed to one. Uh, but be cautious going over any rut or any, we don't have rocks, anything hard because these wheels are so rigid. Um, just take it nice and slow when you're going through any uh, divot or rut in the dirt. Uh, what's nice is you can push or pull this cart, which is very helpful when you have a heavy load. Uh, when you lean it forward, you'll see the yellow frame up front. It's not the strongest in the world, but when you lean it to dump your load, at this point, it'll put all the pressure on that yellow frame, on the steel frame. When you have a load and you go to dump, I do not want to see, and you should not be doing right to left, trying to shake your load out like this. That's how they break this plastic. Once you push it forward any more than what it's at right now, it's going to put all the pressure on this plastic. And sooner rather than later, this plastic will break. So when you go to dump your load, you're pushing it straight forward to where it's vertical up and down. This part is vertical. If you still have manure in this wheelbarrow at that point, um, you can lift it. If you're not strong enough to lift it and dump it that way, bring a small rake with you to scoop it out. But do not lean it right to left to try and dump your load. This will break. And this is this wheelbarrow is what we have moving forward. If we can't fix it, then then we're out of luck. So you can see these four bolts inside. They have washers on them, and they are bolted to the frame on the outside. Check these bolts regularly. Uh, it's just not right that these are constantly breaking and coming loose, and nobody is fixing them. So check these bolts regularly, tighten them if they're loose. You can see, if you can see, there's another one down here by the wheel. Down right there, check these bolts. You can also see the wheel has, I don't know if you can't see, cotter pins that are holding the wheel bearings in place. So check those to make sure that those aren't bent or bending or breaking and let's protect our investment. 